Hello everyone, welcome to my channel, and today I'm actually going to be taking a look at the Chaoser ice cream machine. So in this video, I'm going to break this up into two parts. The initial part, I'm just going to show you the functions of the ice cream machine. We're going to take a look at the manual and some of the accessories. And then I'm actually going to go ahead and make ice cream with this, and I'll show you the end result and give you my feedback. So let's first start with the device itself. You have a dial here that basically can be switched between several different modes. Essentially, you have a single use mode for just general mixing. This icon here where the actual dial is now is for the ice cream mode. So this is mainly where you're going to be. And then you also have these other modes. I'll have to take a look at the manual to get a little bit more detail on that. You do have a piece here up at the top, so this actually spins off and there's both a lock and an unlock mechanism. So when this is unlocked, you have the blade here that simply attaches to the bottom of the base over here. This can be removed and easily cleaned as needed. Pretty much when you're ready to go to load up your ice cream, you have a handle here. This actually will take a little bit of loosening, but this will completely come out. So now you can actually fill this with your ice cream mix and water and get this going. And once you're done, Simply remove this, scoop out the ice cream, put it away in the freezer or start eating, and you're good to go. You do have a fairly good sized length power cord. This is probably about, I'd say, four or five feet. So if you're going to be using this in the kitchen, you have more than enough space to be able to plug this in. It does come with this mixing spoon that you can use as well just to scoop out all the ice cream when you're done. And then you also have this mixing cup as well. This goes up to eight ounces. Now, the manual itself, I'm gonna move the machine out of the way and we'll just take a quick look at the manual. I read through this before starting the video just to get some idea of what to expect. But they give you a bunch of notices on just uh, getting started, general precautions. They kind of show you the whole build out of the machine. But yeah, you have what's called this single refrigeration mode, so that's kind of this ice symbol, and then you have a single mixing mode as well as power off. So, typically you'd be in power off if you want to keep this off. And then obviously we're going to the other modes as we're using it. They just tell you about cleaning all the parts thoroughly before use, and then pretty much you're adding your mix into the bowl, you load in the container, and then you install the lid. The motor assembly, actually add the mixing blade, and that's pretty much it. It's actually extremely easy. You just lock the top lid, set it to the ice cream mode, and then, more or less, this is going to show you what's actually happening because you're going to be able to see right through the lid since it's transparent. It does go over all the different modes, like kind of giving you details about what to expect. There's a keep cool function that will run once the ice cream's done in case you're not there. It has an electrical diagram, any common troubleshooting steps, and then it also has a few ingredients and recipes that you can use for just basic ice cream. So overall, I'm going to actually go ahead, get the ice cream all ready to go, run the machine, and then I'll give you my overall thoughts once we're done. So let's get into it. Okay, so I just wanted to show exactly what it is that I've done here to prepare the ice cream machine. So I basically plug this in, I've gotten all the parts clean, and I'm actually gonna set this to ice cream mode. So I'm just going to flip the switch here. We're going to wait a second to actually do this because it powered on immediately once you do that. But I'm using a product here called Triple Scoop. This has me utilizing a few ingredients. You put a pouch of the Triple Scoop ice cream mix, one cup of milk, one cup of half and half, one cup of heavy whipping cream, and then, obviously, we're going to be using our ice cream maker from Kaosar. So I've gone ahead and used a whisk and a mixing bowl here, mixed everything together, and then I put it into the ice cream bowl that's here. We're going to take this, and we basically just put it right into the machine. This basically has enough for a single quart with this particular ingredient, the ingredients that I have here. So now we're going to take the top here, and this is basically all set to go. We just put this in the lock position, which now it is. And we turn this to ice cream mode. And this will basically start up in a minute. And then I'll show you the end result when this is done. 
All right, so we just finished. I ran this for about 40 minutes or so. The direction said 25 to 30 minutes, but the machine basically will keep running. I did read in the manual that eventually what will happen is this will go over to a cold mode once it's finished. Basically, with this particular mix, you don't have to run it much longer. But as you can see, it's starting to melt, but overall, the thickness of it is fairly good. I did a taste test, and this particular ice cream tastes absolutely awesome. So, I'm excited. Basically, all you have to do is now transfer this to your own container, and then simply put it in the freezer, and you can eat it any time. Anyway, thanks for checking out my video review. Hopefully you found this helpful, and I will talk to you later.